So now I am signing into PlayStation Network. Hopefully this will work now. Yeah, it's online. Now we will start the Modern Warfare once again. We will go back. We will connect to online. Yeah, see now we can see only co-op is not working. Okay. Uh, this Warzone is complete, multiplayer is there, campaign is there. I'll just show campaign, I understand. Yeah, I can play campaign. Go back, we we'll connect to online. Yeah, see now we can see only co op is not working. Okay, uh, this Warzone is complete, multiplayer is there, campaign is there. I'll just show campaign, I understand. So basically it is working guys, I will just show you the campaign just to show that it is working. Sorry. This Battery 90%. So guys, there is only one important step here. That one important step which involves you to make and make sure that your account location matches your disk location if not you will not be able to download the necessary dlcs that was the problem i had to unnecessarily uninstall all the things which was not at all required you just had to create an account which has a uh, uh, which has a matching uh, location as of your disk for my disk it was marked as all that means no region specific but even then also only when I in, uh, used an account based on US I was able to download it. You might even need, in some scenarios you might even need to use a wireless connection which has a pre-configured VPN person that is you have to uh, create a proxy from uh, maybe US or given location whichever you need. Sergeant Garrett, Roger up. Go for Garrett. Current threat level is now critical. Possible hospital attack. Hello guys, uh, uh, I've been searching for this uh, problem since quite some long and I finally found the solution. My problem was that uh, my disk version which was marked as global uh, means all access was uh, not actually all access I believe. Because whenever I am trying to download the necessary DLCs it is showing that DLC is not available in your location kind of message whenever I am inside the game. So finally I figured it out how hard to do. So you need to follow up these exact steps to get your things done. So the first step involves like you have to get a download uh, of the 90 GB update in your PS4. And if you have already done that you can you may try this without deleting it first. So the, if you have already done the 90 GB update and your campaign multiplayer and the special ops are not working and you are only able to play modern warfare warzone you don't you can try this first the first step second step involved delete a user profile which is also not necessary if you have if you can create an extra uh, profile then you don't have to delete any profile so create a uh, region specific user profile what it means is you have to create a user profile which should be matching the region mentioned in your disk so you can be either one two or all i believe one stands for us so you have to create a playstation account uh, which is in which you should mention the address location everything as us okay that is most important so your uh, ps account ps play, playstation account should match the location of the disk otherwise this is not going to work so um, once that's done you can now open up your already downloaded updated uh, game and open up your call of duty modern warfare game and select whichever install is suspended so for me it was campaign multiplayer and spec ops so i just down uh, clicked campaign and uh, voila it started installing the remaining packs you you can come outside and it will you can select the necessary packs which you need and you can start installing all those so i've done that and now it is working fine for me so uh, uh the thing is that uh, some of the users this might not work because 
what happens is that once you have installed the 90 GB update and you started accessing your modern warfare, you would have already created an account in which you have accidentally mentioned your own location. So that will not work now. So what to do? You have to do it all again. So what you can do is now you have to uninstall all the data. Then you download the 90 GB update first. Once installed, once installed, you before uh, before downloading the or installing the disk, you create a new profile first. That should be the first thing with the location and everything matched. And then you download the 90 GB update using that profile. Install everything into the disk. You install the CD into the using that profile. You download everything into the using that profile. And then once the 90 GB update is over, you go inside and uh, you open up the modern warfare again and then again you have to enter the new user id using a new email that is start step three this is uh, and uh, based on your location you mark your uh, region and and then go to the menu where you have to download the other things then this will work guys you can actually now start downloading the unnecessary dlcs which is required for this thing to work and uh, mark me without the DLCs. This game you want both. You can only play Warzone even if you download the 90 GB. Once everything is downloaded, now the game is close to 164 GB. And, uh, so I don't know whether it's worth the efforts, but I tried my best because I am a huge fan of Call of Duty. Now it is working. I can play a campaign. Just see the videos which I have attached now. Thank you.